Hi, Kathy here with 3-Minute Piano Lessons. So here we go in the key of E. Uh, the last video I'd given you the scales for the right hand and the left hand. Plus, on the second page of what I'd given you, it was the one chord uh, and the inversions of, uh, well, yeah, the one, four, five chords, which are the primary chords, again, in E major. We've been covering this now for some time. So uh, here on this board, I have the four sharps up in the key signature, so we know we're in the key of E major. Again, to acclimate you to my board, this would be middle C. So it wouldn't be this E that I'm talking about here. It would be the low E, and it has its own ledger line. And again, please uh, remember that we're in the F clef, so don't get yourself confused. This is not middle C. So I covered that in the past video, so be sure you're in the low, down in low E. So here's your one chord in uh, E. And so you'd have the G sharp, and up here I have marked in bright pink all the keys that would be sharp. There's four of them. And so there's your one chord, and to invert the one chord, you would uh, take that E and put it here on top, and there you have G sharp, B, and E. So finger five would be on that G sharp. Now in order to play these well, just move your hand into the keys. Be sure your little finger, finger five on this G sharp, goes into the keyboard, uh, so you're not hanging out and hanging your thumb out here on the E. You want to keep a nice ball in your hand. I really can't demonstrate it very well because I'm on the board, but I'll try to do that in another video. But just to practice, move your hand up into the keyboard so, there, so you keep that ball in your hand and you're over the keys. So you have a good hand position. You have a good grip on that G sharp with your little finger. Your little finger is a weak finger. So, uh, so that's your one chord inverted. So let's do the four chord inversion briefly. And again, I put them all out here. These are all in the bass clef. Uh, I chose to do that this time. This would be the A, C sharp, and E. There's your four chord. And uh, again, to invert that, we're gonna put C sharp on the bottom, E there, and the A on top. Now see how close you are to the middle C here already. And then we also inverted the five chord. So from E, one, two, three, four, five, B is on the bottom, D sharp's in the middle, and now you have an F sharp. So that feels strange, but move your hand into the keys and get a good strong grip on your uh, B, D sharp there with finger three, and then your thumb would be finger one on F sharp. So that is included with this video, so practice your uh, inversions uh, on the primary chords. See you next time.